Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel, Mississippi Girl Life. A little bit about me, I am Tamika, just a country Mississippi girl living in North Carolina. I am the wife to a Marine Corps veteran who is also a New York City boy. I am 34 years old and I am the mother to three children ages 15, 12, and 11. My channel is a variety channel aimed to inspire and motivate you in many different ways. Also, don't forget to check out the description box because it contains many special links. Please like, comment, and subscribe because it does help out the channel. I hope you guys enjoy my content and I will see you in the video. Hey y'all, so in this video I'm going to be sharing with y'all the medicines that I have stocked up on um, for emergencies. You know, if there's a medication, medication shortages, there are recalls on medicines um, along with the food shortages, water shortages all that type of stuff so it's important not only to stock up on food but also stock up on medicines and stuff um, especially if it's over the counter if you can find them medicines and stuff that you and your family may need so I'm gonna go over a couple things that I have stocked up on for my household um, and keep in mind everybody household is different everybody needs is different so while you can get this stuff if you can find this stuff in your area because a lot of you guys are saying that you haven't seen shortages and then a lot of you guys are saying oh now I'm starting to see them so just keep in mind it's very important to stock up on whatever it is that you can get so let me just go ahead and share you share with you guys what um, I am stocking up on for my family and hopefully it'll give you guys some ideals or you may not even you may be even doing this and may not have it on your list um, it may remind somebody you know whatever the case may be so let's go ahead and get into it okay y'all so I'm gonna start with um, the items that's already open that we uses so y'all already know um, if you've been following me I told you I take Pepsi AC which is for motodane for acid reflux and GERD I have been on prescription ones like um, a Prolisec and all that stuff. Prolisec, well I haven't been on Nexium, but I've been on different things and it don't work but I've been taking this ever since I was like 7 years old um, off and on so I have to have these. These work perfectly for me. So these are what I'm using now. Also these are some Tylenol. I don't do well with pills so I think Hubby was taking these um, some months ago or something. Um, but I know if anybody needs Tylenol, it will be him taking the pill ones. Advil's is normally my go-to, but since my GERD really started acting up on me, I became to where I can't really tolerate Advil. And anybody that deals with GERD and acid reflux, you'll find that you, you can't, um, that Advil and Motrin is not good for the GERD. Um, so yeah, but I do have some in case I have to, you know, you know, in case the Tylenol don't work. This is my go-to for Tylenol, which is the dissolvable packs. Um, so yeah, me and my 15-year-old can take the um, Tylenol, the dissolvable packs. I think it's for 12, so that means my son too, because my kids are 15, 12, and 11. So yes, but also for them, um, because they're tiny, um, they can also still take the chewables. So I have some of the Tylenol chewables that's been open. They have used out of these too. Right here, I think we was actually out and about and I forgot to bring my little pouch that I keep like on the go medications in like Tylenol, Advil, or my Pepsi they see and it goes with me everywhere in my purse. But I think I had forgot it at home and hubby, this was like months and months ago, hubby needed some pain medicine. Um, I think it was for an earache or something. And so he stopped and at the dollar store, I think it was um, Family Dollar, and just grabbed this right here. So that's why we have this on hand, um, and that's why it was open. And then, of course, um, we had some of the liquid Tylenol, but I won't be buying any more of the liquid Tylenol because, like I say, my kids is older now. So um, I'll probably just buy the chewable for the for the 11 year old, um, and then you know the 12 year old. Let me see, I think these are for 12. 12 and older but um my son and perhaps we can take one of the dissolvable um packs so i i prefer the dissolvable tylenol okay so this is what i have um open also the only thing that's not right here open is let me get it so y'all can see all right y'all so i had to get a few more medications that i forgot um so this is my flonase it is very important that i have flonase um, I am allergic to weeds, grass, 
dust mites in my dog. <laughs> um, so this right here really really helps but I, I get sinus issues and stuff really really bad like at, like really bad so I need this this is a steroid and so it helps very quickly for me um I've been doing Flonase ever since a child too I've been on Claritin ever since I was about seven same as the Pepsi Day C um, my Lana been about around the same time um, and we got some Philip Mickle Magnesia. Been using this since a child. It's for anybody that may need to poop, okay? And can't poop, you just you don't want to be in an emergency situation, and, and you need some because the fiber from the apple juice just ain't working, okay? So um, we have some of this on hand, and this is all the stuff that is open, like I said, that's being used, okay? So y'all get an idea of the things that I'm about to show you. Um, it's off. It's based off of what we use, okay? And, and some of the stuff I've been on for a while, I know how it works for me. Like I say, um, like the Milana, the Pepsi, the Claris. I've been on since like seven years old or younger, and I'm 34, right? I'm 34 now, so that's a long time. And they work for me perfectly, okay? So it's important that I keep these things on hand. Now over here is my little st is our little stash, okay? So some of the stuff I got just a day ago, okay? So I picked up another Pepsi Day C, another Pepsi Day C, another Pepsi Day C. Now mind you, I did stock up last year, but then you know we didn't kind of went through some of it because I wasn't I was I was just getting back into my prepping routine. Um after I had stopped for a couple years and I already explained that y'all military life you moved a lot so it wasn't no reason I don't have to go into that but that's just the short version of it okay so I started back up so um, now that I'm in full swing of prepping again um, I'm starting back getting even more even more so a day ago I was able to get um, these let me see I got these three boxes of Pepsi AC I got this Claritin um, it's a 30 count and I got one of these my lanters um just the other day okay um now i already had on hand an extra my lana um i already had this diamond tap cold and cough for the kids also got some children motrin because it's a little strong i normally get children advil but i did pick this one up the other day too i did pick this one up the other day so yeah um then i have um some gas X. Went on and picked up some more gas X. I didn't pick these up the other day. I had these as already part of a stash because sometimes um, if I have a lot of air, I may have to take one of these. I am in the same that I have taken from the Pepsi Day C. It just depends, okay? Um, so it's always good for me to have these on hand. Um, also, right here is some mylocons my my kids all three of my kids have acid reflux and well they have GERD they've been diagnosed with GERD um so I gotta this is gonna go on my list as to get some more of these I have to get some more of these um a lot more of these okay because believe it this stash right here the way I grew up this <laughs> if, I, if I if my granny was still alive and she saw me only had this right here you know, she'd be like it's a, it's a start but you know you need more than that <laughs> and I know that I gotta I gotta get more stuff um, especially more of these for the kids um because they do have to take these when they having their GERD issues um also take, got some um vape rub this normally comes in handy for the kids if they get a cold or something to rub on their chest so I need to get some more vape rub also, I got a box of children's um, Tylenol chewables that is not open. Like I said, um, this will be enough for like my 11-year-old um, because my 12 and 15-year-old can now take these um, dissolvable packs. So when I buy more Tylenol, it will be the dissolvable packs. Um, but yeah, I do have some chewables and I've been had these. Um, that's it for that. Now right here a day ago, we did stock up on the sanitizer and the reason why is CVS check your CVS because these um was 29 cents so these are all hand sanitizers for 29 cents now let me just go ahead and tell you y'all know I am a couponer okay and it's been hard to coupon in my area due to the current situation 
um with the shortages and stuff and just they not even offering the coupons and the inserts and and the new the newspaper stands are closed and it's just a whole lot i can't get the coupons like i want but i did have some ecbs i had 21 dollars in ecbs and that is what went on this because this 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 one of these and four little kit kat bars because <laughs> that's what you don't see here was eighty dollars and i used my um after my rewards at cvs and my um 21 dollars i got it down to 44 dollars um but yeah if i would have went in there and didn't have no none of my rewards or anything it would have been eighty dollars y'all eighty dollars for just three packs of pepsi ac a thing of claritin and a milana um was eighty dollars so having you know my ecbs from my couponing that that is that you know that 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 helped out a lot so that is what my medicine stash look like for everything that's not open that's actual stash that's not this is my extended stash right now this is my working stash so um yeah so i hope this gave y'all some tips um motivated y'all maybe you saw something that i'm carrying that you may not have on your list or may not have um and like i say every time i get something every time i get something i will let y'all know um they'll do a haul on it and let y'all know what is what um hopefully i can find some deals using my digital coupons on a lot of this stuff so if you are couponers don't forget your digital because i understand you know in certain areas we can't coupon we can't extreme coupon like we normally would um and it's crazy man it's crazy i used to say i never think i would stop couponing but look what happened i don't have a choice because the stuff is just not there so you know i rather instead of spending my money on inserts i rather just that i can't use the coupons for i rather just go ahead and um take that money and just use my digital coupons and get the item so i'm thankful for that check out them clearance fines y'all for items when you go into stores like i say these sanitizers was 29 cents each so that was a good deal right there okay y'all so that's the end of the video i hope y'all had an amazing time watching and you enjoyed the content once again don't forget to check out the information in the description box below also like comment and subscribe because like i said it helps out the channel and i hope y'all have a safe rest of your day morning or whenever you are watching this video be safe and i will see you in the next one if this god's will bye